Hey everyone, Mount Silver Hiker here and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm opening up this brand new, newly released RCSV collection box. Now, this is an absolutely amazing collection box. If you watch other YouTubers, if you watch, you know, um, other YouTube Pokemon videos, you know that everybody's raving about this box. It's absolutely amazing. And hopefully that this turns out to be a great video because that will inspire you to buy this product for yourself as well. If you want, they're being sold at, at MSRP uh, on GameStop's website and on the Pokemon Center as well. So without further ado, let's crack into these boxes. Let's see what all the hype is about. Let's see if it's warranted because we have two of these RCSV uh, boxes to open. I have a lot, a lot in my collection, but uh, these came with a little bit of a nick. These uh, boxes are all dinged up, so I wanted to start with these. So let's get started. So first things first, one of the reasons that a lot of people are so excited about this uh, collection box is because of the promo cards that you see in front of me. This RCSV Alt Art card is absolutely gorgeous and if you've played the Legends RCS video game on the Switch, you know exactly like the background, the map coronet, just such an amazing, amazing promo card. So very, very easily why, a big reason why this uh, collection box is really sought after and a big reason why I think it's an absolutely amazing product. I have so many of these boxes that uh, I will be opening on the channel, but also to keep for the long term as well. And I really like how the boxes actually protect these uh, promo cards. As you can see, the edges and corners aren't dinged up at all. So that little nick right there, it's actually part of the sleeve and not of the card. The card is absolutely pristine. So let me sleeve both of these up. An absolutely amazing. Uh, promo card to come. I think the Pokemon, ha they have really been knocking it out of the park with some of their higher end uh, products and the promo cards in it. If you, you know, the, some of the things that come to mind, the Jolteon, the Vaporeon, the Flareon, just absolutely amazing products. The pack inside weren't amazing, but you know, just because of the promo cards, those boxes are so hard to find. I'm still missing a Vaporeon one. All right, and next up, each box comes with one of their own Arceus uh, figures. This is an absolutely amazing, just the details on it. See the red on the eyes, just everything about the figure is really, really cool. So I have, I'll have a lot of these as well if I'm opening up a bunch of the boxes. But of course, another reason, uh, one of the biggest reasons I send this box over the top outside of the promo card is the packs. Now, they, it comes with the Chilling Rain pack, which is the least exciting pack of the box, uh, if I'm being uh, completely honest. It has two Brilliant Stars packs, a, a set that's absolutely amazing, regardless of how poorly it has been treating me. I'm just, I've been struggling with the pulls, but you know, I'm not giving up. Uh, this set is amazing. It has evolutions in it, so I'll be opening up more Brilliant Stars, uh, especially four more in today's video. But the star of the show, and something that everybody was talking about was that each of these boxes, the latest release of the Pokemon Center Company sealed Pokemon card product has a pack of Cosmic Eclipse in every box, you know? And if you don't know, right now, Cosmic Eclipse, um, a lot of people talk about Cosmic Eclipse as had being an amazing set. It's of the Sun and Moon era. But like even on TCG Player, if you want to buy loose packs of Cosmic Eclipse, they range from like $8 all the way to $10, $11. So just to have one in a box that is $25 with an amazing promo card and three other packs is just a very, very fair deal. And I'm really happy that, you know, anyone can get these boxes. They, they've been on GameStop's website for weeks now. I see them on um, Pokemon Center. Just... If you're interested in at all whatsoever in these boxes, I would recommend you get some. And I have the pictures to prove it that I believe I have a lot of faith in the long-term value of these boxes. So I purchased quite a bit myself and I'll continue buying them. So what you're here for is not for me to talk about, you know, Cosmic Eclipse to rave about that. You want me to open these packs. So let's get started with Chilling Rain. Let's get these out of the way. Um, I think Chilling Rain I'm looking for the golden shiny Pokemon. I think there's like a, there's Snorlax in there and I think there's Bronzong. So those are the chase cards. I'm not entirely sure what else is in there outside of the uh, the new regional birds. So we have, we have water energy, impact energy, Porygon 2, Blacky, Cast Form, Sphiel, Hatena, Rockruff, 
shop it. A reverse holo should be next. Yes, it is. It's a reverse holo hatena. And our first hit of the video is a Galarian Weezing non holo. So a regional Weezing. Not a hit, but that's okay. Because we want the hits to be in the Cosmic Eclipse and the Brilliant Stars pack. So let's see if that's in the cards for today. Okay, forward to the front. All right, we have Water Energy. Haunter, Flannery, Crabomitable, Furfru, Venipede, Sfeel, Crabrawler, Golet, our reverse holo should be next. Yes, it is. It's a reverse holo Weedle. Love this Weedle artwork. I absolutely adore the hair crossing crunches in the back. And our hit is a Walrein non holo. All right, so as expected, chilling rain, more like chilling pain. So nothing there, but that's fine. You know, we all we want to funnel all of the luck into the cosmic eclipse and the ooh and the brilliant stars. I didn't plan for this, but we have an art set in front of us. So typically, I go, I start with uh, the pack art that I'm least excited about, and I just try to build up momentum to the pack that I'm more excited about. So what we have in here. Or to the front. All right, we have a Metal Energy, Acerola's Premonition, Collapse Stadium, Crawdon, Piplup, Shroomish, we have Throw, Cast Form, Trap Pinch, our Reverse Hollow should be next. It's a Reverse Hollow Axew, very nice. And our hit is a Wormadam Non Hollow. The Wormadams just haunt me for this set. All right. Um, all right, now let's move into the Shaman pack. Ooh, try not to spoil myself by not looking at the code cards. So, the side, forward to the front. I have a water energy, a lot of water energies in this video. Is this our third one or our fourth one? Third one, our third one. We have first two had water energy and then a metal energy. Fresh water set, Sigilyph, Chimeco, Electabuzz. Bidoof, a Sneasel, Grimer, our Reverse Hollow is next. It's a Reverse Hollow Trap Inch, a Reverse Hollow Action, the Reverse Hollow Trap Inch, very nice. And our hit is a Tornadus Non Hollow. So the Brilliant Stars pain continues, unfortunately, for your favorite hiker of Mount Silver. He uh, is getting beaten down by. Oh, we have a V-Star that replaces the energy card. So very nice, we have a V-Star card. Um, but yeah, the, the pain continues with Brilliant Stars. We have Marnie's Pride, Patrisu, Blunder Policy, Execute, Farfetch'd, Duskull, Kupchu, Dedene. Ooh, we have a Reverse Hollow Patrisu, very nice. And our hit is a Haxorus non Hollow. Three packs, three non hollows. Let's see if, uh, see this Charizard <laughs> pack art will save us. It's uh, not looking, not looking bright here. So, let's see, oh, don't remember. Ooh, ooh, I think I saw something. I am terrible at moving code cards. I think this pack might be breaking our bad luck. We'll see, we'll see. We have a darkness, dark energy, executor, pot helmet, Claydol, Axew, a Spirit Tomb, Clink, a Sneasel, Turtwig, Reverse Hollow is next. It's a Reverse Hollow Cast Form. I saw something silver. I hope it's not the Cast Form that I saw silver. And our last Brilliant Stars pack has a. What's our hit? Ooh, we have a Kindler a Rainbow Rare. A Rainbow Rare Kindler has been pulled. So. Finally, a bit of luck to come out of Brilliant Stars in, in the form of a Rainbow Rare Trainer. I'll take it. At this point, I'll take what I can get. Very, very nice. Uh, oh, I guess it's like, um, it's like a Fire Energy uh, NPC. So, very nice. I'll set that to the side right next to my uh, Arceus's as well. And now, let's crack into Cosmic Eclipse. Cosmic Eclipse is definitely a set that I did not really collect all that much of um, because this was a, a bit before I got into you know, Pokemon card collecting. 
it was a hidden face was the first set that like I really that drew my eye and, and then that's what, around when I started collecting so let's see what all the hype is about in regards to Cosmic Eclipse let's see if we have a hit in one of these packs all right we have a dark energy oh let me zoom in a little bit dark energy ends resolve mawile jolteon phantom we have rowlet stuffle we have rockruff alolan vulpix our reverse hollow is a cosmog and our hit is a Ooh, wow, okay, we have a team up like a team up GX card. We have Blastoise and Piplup GX. Very, very nice. So one of my first uh, Cosmic Eclipse packs, M might be my first one. I genuinely don't remember opening up Cosmic e Eclipse in the past. And we have this amazing team up card, Blastoise and Piplup GX. Very, very nice. Uh, quite, quite off center, but you know, it's a hit. We'll take it. And now, down to our last pack. Let's see if this Cosmic Eclipse also has a hit in it. And that's what I said earlier in this video. I said, you know, it's perfectly fine if Chilling Rain does not have a hit, because we want our hits to be in the Brilliant Stars and Cosmic Eclipse packs. And that's basically what happened. I got one, a good hit out of four packs of Brilliant Star, and I'm one for one on Cosmic Eclipse so far. So let's see if we can end this video on another hit. See if we're two for two on Cosmic Eclipse. A Phantom, Rowlet, Stuffle, a Rockruff, our Reverse Hall is another Phantom, and our final hit of this video is a Como O Hollow. Yeah, so it's a Hollow. It's you know I'll take it. But beats and having a non-Hollow. So there we go. So that was our first RCSV collection box opening, and I think it was a pretty good success. I we, we walk away with the promo cards that are absolutely amazing. Uh, the Rainbow Rare Trainer card and an amazing GX card out of the Cosmic Eclipse packs. So I will definitely be opening more of these boxes. I'll definitely be purchasing more of these boxes because I think they're absolutely amazing, you know, just to open or to hold long term. And maybe um, in the future, if I wanted to do something with the, the background, these def boxes will definitely be part of it. Anyways, if you purchase these boxes, I would love to know. Uh, what polls you've gotten and what do you think about Cosmic Eclipse because this is my first experience with it. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Mount Silver Hiker, out.